tutorial center owner, a math teacher, and an author of 21 math books. Some of my recent books are the following. College Entrance Reviewer Book 1, College Entrance Reviewer Book 2, Core Concepts High School Entrance Reviewer. This book can be used for any high school entrance preparation in any school, but you can use it also for science high schools like Philippine Science High School, Makati Science High School, Marikina Science High School, and any science high school because I made sure that the exercises here in math were really of depth and they are fit for any high school, especially the science high schools. We also have here PSHS Reviewer Volume 3 and Volume 4. Okay. You can buy them online. My channel is all about math tutorials. I will be discussing some mathematics lessons, exercises, sample exam questions, which will help you for your high school entrance exam review, for your college entrance exam review, for your SAT, and for your ordinary math classes. So, shall we start? Click the subscribe button and go, go, go. Welcome. This is our first math lesson. These two problems here normally appear in any high school entrance exam or, or also in any college entrance exam. I normally give this to my students at the tutorial center and they normally cannot solve it in less than one minute. Why? Because they are multiplying all the numerators which takes them 5 to 10 minutes and then divide it by all the, the product of all the denominators which will take them another 5 minutes. But today, I'm going to teach you how to do it the shortcut way. Okay, this is it. Listen. Find numbers which are cancelable, for example, 16, divided by 16 gives you 1. So we can write the answer here, 1 and 1. What else can you cancel? We can cancel 81 by 81, because 81 divided by 81 gives you 1. We can also cancel 42 by 7. 7 divided by 7 is 1. 42 divided by 7 is 6. And of course, 25 over 25 gives you 1. Then multiply all the results. 1 times 1 times 6 times 1 will give you 6 over 1 times 1 times 1 times 1 is 1. And you know that 6 over 1 is 6. You can try number 2. How do we do number 2 again? Find one numerator and denominator which are cancelable. So we can see that 64 over 64 is 1. What else? You see that 9 and 27 are both divisible by 9. So 9 divided by 9 is 1. 27 divided by 9 is 3. Then, obviously now, 48 can be cancelled by 48. You also get 1, 1. So 1 times 1 times 1 is 1 over 1 times 3 times 1 is 3. So your final answer is now 1 for Get it? Good. Okay, before I leave, remember the following. Add kindness, subtract judgment, multiply understanding equals Mrs. O's good luck.